Hello and welcome back to Accounting Information Systems and Controls, ACCT 146, for those of you that are wondering. Um, my name is Fernando Parra, just in case you didn't know. Uh, I am going to go over our data visualization project today. Uh, as we recall, we covered XBRL, Extensive uh, um, Business Markup Language, in the last lesson and today we're going to go a little further by actually analyzing the data that we were able to download using xbrl uh, with our tableau software so what is the purpose of this particular project well let's take a look at this students will learn to download data from the sec's electronic data gathering analysis and retrieval system which is edgar and we did that in our previous session uh, in addition students will be able to format data to perform uh, descriptive data analytics of financial performance ratios for a subset of Fortune 500 companies. Now, all of you have been assigned to a specific company. If you click on this particular website, oh, I'm sorry, that, that click, um, it shows everybody's assigned corporation. And then it gives you a group by which you want to compare and contrast your assigned company using the data that was downloaded using the XBRL. You saw how important XBRL is nowadays so that you can um, analyze data across companies uh, with standardized labels for data elements in our financial statements. Why is that important? We're about to see why is that. So follow me through this road. I'm going to turn off my video because I think it's distracting. But after that, uh, we'll get started with the first element. 